Thank you for joining me for another time of daily devotions in three minutes or less where we get to start off our day together sharing God's word with each other. Today we're going to look at Romans chapter 8 verses 24 to 26 and here's what it says. For we were saved in this hope, but hope that is seen is not hope. For why does one still hope for what he sees? For if we hope for what we do not see, we eagerly wait for it with perseverance. Likewise, the Spirit also helps in our weaknesses, for we do not know what we should pray for as we ought, but the Spirit himself makes intercession for us with groanings which cannot be uttered. You know, when I read this, it's so significant and so powerful because it tells us that a part of God himself wants to save us so much and he wants to give us that hope so much that he has his own Holy Spirit praying for us to strengthen us. That means you, when you are going through your temptation and when you're going through your sin and when you're in those moments where you just feel defeated or maybe you've just sinned and now you're convicted and you feel like, man, I've messed up. You shouldn't feel justified because you've sinned and you're like, oh yes, I've committed a sin, God will forgive me. No, you should never abuse grace. But know that no matter what circumstance you're in, because you're saved by Jesus Christ, the Holy Spirit is making intercession for you in that special heavenly language. He is interceding on your behalf with the Father and with Jesus, who's also right at the side of God interceding for you as well. God himself wants you to be victorious and a part of him is praying for you to prosper and to be empowered. So I want you to realize the power that God is giving you today and walk in victory. Guys, have an awesome day today. God bless you. Take care.